Start recording. Stop recording. Play Feed Button. the Girls by Amateur Transplants. Now playing Feed the Girls by Amateur This is a faster version of Feed Ketsia. At supper time, Ketsia gets so afraid. At supper time, when she hears the table laid, because of her bulimia, and our sister doesn't know, she throws her face inside a towel after supper time. But say a prayer for all the anxified at supper time. It's hard to hide it from Smidver. Kets your ways less than an iPod, which is practically 2D. Meet the wish it was Smidver instead of Meadver. There's no F-O-O-D in Ketsia this supper time. The only thing she'll say tonight is... She's got a torso like a hose. They'll have to seed her through her nose. Will Ketsia know it's supper time at all? Elena, you take this, because Damon can't really. Feed Ketsia, will they know it's supper time? Feed Ketsia, will they know it's supper time? Feed Ketsia, will they know it's supper time? Feed Ketsia. Play Delaney's Donkey by Waldorf String Band. Okay, let's hear Delaney's Donkey by Waldorf String Band. Now the Nicholsons had huskies that everyone admired To permanently stop and are never ever tired A leg at every corner, balancing their heads And a tail to let you know which end they wanted to be fed Smoid was smiling Hello, battery Why not train them? Then they took a rag They rubbed them, scrubbed them They old and lubricated them Got them to a post And when the star had dropped the flag There was Smoid Pushing him, shoving him, and shushing him. Me, Sandra, me, Sha, and everyone in town. Lined up attacking him and shoving him and stacking him. They might as well have tried to push the Tesco down. The Huskies were eyeing him, openly defying them, humping, jumping, and twisting out of place. Carol reversing him, everybody cursing him. The day the Nickers and Huskies ran the FOD race. The muscles of the mighty, never known to flinch. They couldn't move the huskies a quarter of an inch. Craig lay exhausted, sleeping like a goat, with the grip just like an Irishman on a ten pound note. Starter Carter, he lined up with the rest of them. When they saw them, they were willing then. They raced up, raced up, ready for the best of them. They started off to cheer, but then they changed their mind again. There was Smythe pushing him, shoving him, and shushing him. Sandra, Misha, and Carol in the car. She started poking him and grabbing him and stroking him. They kicked her in the bustle and she said, Sparf off. The sods and the chestnuts, them over him, the tesnals, tesnals and throwers, they hurried to the place, stood there in unity, helping the community the day the Nichols and Suskies ran the FOD race. The crowd began to cheer them, and Stephanie, the judge, she came up to assist them, and still they wouldn't budge. The jockeys who were riding them, Craig and Pampus three, were so thoroughly disgusted that they went in at the tea. Hagen Fagen were students of psychology, so they'd shift them with some dynamite. They bought it, brought it, and without apology, the Huskies blew his knees and blew the whole lot out of sight. There was Smyber pushing him, shoving him, and shushing him. Ketsia, Seely, and all the travellers' crew, police and auxiliary, the FBI artillery, the seconds and the navy, and the lifeguards too. The city stitched and harried them and picked them up and carried them, cheered them, steered them to the winning place. 
Then the bookies drew aside. No really sleepified. The day the Nichols and Huskies won the FOOD race. Play the Rising of the Moon by the Dubliners. Playing the Rising of the Moon by the Dubliners. <laughs> Still recording. Stop recording. Because so, I have a date with dinner and the core is overflowed. I bear orders from my stepchild. Get the dinner ready soon. For we all must eat together at the falling of the spoon. At the falling of the spoon. At the falling of the spoon. For we all must eat together at the falling of the spoon. And come tell me, Pam Nicholson, where the gathering is to be. Near Jubilee, computer is quite well known to you and me. One more word or a silver present, whistle out the Saviour's tune. With your trumpet on your shoulder at the falling of the spoon. At the falling of the spoon. At the falling of the spoon. With your trumpet on your shoulder at the falling of the spoon. Out from many a nosy halver, eyes were watching through the night. Many a vampire's heart was beating for the blessed morning light. Dogs round there began to rally, they were asking for a chew. But the bleemics like me purging by the falling of the spoon. By the falling of the spoon, by the falling of the spoon. All bulimics like me purging by the falling of the spoon. All along that dog-filled pathway, many a homeless dog was seen. By a hopeful new companion for a dog's love to redeem. And to every dog abuser, whistle out the Saviour's tune. For we all must eat for extant, tis the falling of the spoon. Tis the falling of the spoon, tis the falling of the spoon. For we all must eat it for extant, tis the falling of the spoon. Play Sweary Tale of New York by Amateur Transplants. Oh, come on. Listen, button. Li Listen. Play Sweary Tale of New York by Amateur Transplants. Why are you not working, you stupid iPad? Here's Sweary Tale of Oh, there we go. By Amateur Transplants. Hey, Daryl. Hey, Carol. Why are you leaving me in this place, you daft spoffer? Twas Grimes is Eve. I'm on the forecourt to buy a present from Woodbury Cafe. There's packs of cigarettes. There's packs of dogs' towels. There's boys' own audio cassettes. And sacks of charcoal briquettes. Because you're an ungrateful bar steward that doesn't give a spoff about anyone, Daryl. You get spoffed. Where the fuck have you been? I've been waiting for hours. Oh, don't look so mad, Daryl. I've bought you some flowers. These flowers are deceased and they're from our front lawn. There have also bought biscuits, a book and some porn. You're an ungrateful bastard for pulling this stunt. You knobhead, you shitbag, you damn man hell numb. But you I don't need tweezers to handle my penis. Stick a torch up your ass, make this grand as they are last. And everywhere around the world, from here to Botany Bay, there are couples splitting up on Grimes's day. <laughs> Play Hallelujah by Amateur Transplants. Here's Hallelujah by Amateur Transplants. Mm. 
I'll sing about my world. Dice World, now, really your role with Sir Dice and, and, and the punchlines in the chorus, so I won't spoil it. I recommend you understand bulimics always wash their hands between purging it and going to the toilet. F O O D F O O D F O O D F O O D I'll tell you about a spoffer who cannot be asked with cleaning too and you'll guess this cause you'll know Smythe's a hoarder she doesn't really care at all whether one of the dogs should fall or about my complex eating disorder lazy Smythe lazy Smythe Lazy Smythe, Lazy Smythe. If you went back a century and suffered something dietary, that meant you had to have an intubation. You'd suffer pain. But not today, cause now there is an easier way So you do not remember this occasion Mind compulsion Mind compulsion Mind compulsion Mind compulsion This is a phrase that people say with certain food disorders, yea. They'll say it many times throughout December. They'll say it first when friends come in and offer them F-O-O-D. They'll say this because they want them to remember. I'm bulimic. I'm bulimic. I'm bulimic, I'm bulimic It's time to have another try This one is a medical diagnosis Where one restricts what they're eating Cause every time they yawn or speak F.O.O.D. is purged onto people's seats And everybody leaves the room full of seats Food disorder Food disorder Food disorder Food disorder Let's talk about a type of shop where you can never buy a chop or sausages or any kind of pretzels or crackling or pork or crisps or what the Americans know as chips. If you disagree, then you are quite misled. The folly boff, folly boff. Folly boff, folly boff. That last punchline was quite obscure, but you will guess this one, I'm sure, cause not to work it out would be quite shocking. It won't take that much thought at all This phrase is something logical That Thessalonians might say at time of mocking Hello Sparfa Hello Sparfa Hello Sparfa Hello Sparfa Hello, 
A recent holiday for me was 15 miles from Foley, a cultural but weird destination. It's not a trip I much enjoyed because my transaction was void by the damn Department of Immigration in Preston. In Preston, in Preston, in Preston. Some people notice with dismay their FOD intake low one day from problems with cyberbullying or malnutrition. I'll tell you what this illness is As long as you don't take the piss For the proper name of this FOOD loss condition Induced bulimia Induced bulimia Induced bulimia Induced bulimia And taking a wash all through my life I've cleaned myself with this device It's made out of two metals in a mixture I'm not sure if it's iron or zinc Or maybe it has silver in But either way I think you'll get the picture Alloy loofer Alloy loofer Alloy loofah, alloy loofah. There have been beds that through the years we've had been changed once or twice a year, like this bed here, whose job needs explanation. It's something that's been double trained A bed cover that's been ordained Essential for a bedtime confrontation Holy cover Holy cover Holy cover Holy cover I'll tell you about a type of sweet I hope you'll never have to eat It's chewy and it's made with seeds and honey Alarmingly, it's full of cheese A salty cheese comes from Burnley It's not a taste forgotten in a hurry Sedil to nougat Sedil to nougat Sedil to nugget, sedil to nugget. Play for He's a Jolly Good Fellow by Baby Genius. Okay, let's hear for He's a Jolly Good Fellow by Baby Genius. For Ketsia's eating disorder, Ketsia's eating disorder, Ketsia's eating disorder has gone out of control, has gone out of control, has gone out of control. For Ketsia's eating disorder, for Ketsia's eating disorder, for Ketsia's eating disorder has gone out of control. She's a diagnosed bulimic, she's a diagnosed bulimic, she's a diagnosed bulimic, we know what it is now, we know what it is now, we know what it is now, she's a diagnosed bulimic, she's a diagnosed bulimic, she's a diagnosed bulimic, we know what it is now. But Ketsy is refusing help, but Ketsy is refusing help. Ketsy is refusing help, it is a load of spoff. 
It is a load of spoff. It is a load of spoff. For Ketsy is refusing help. For Ketsy is refusing help. Ketsy is refusing help. It is a load of spoff. Thank <laughs> you.